Long before the beginning of civilization, humanity has always had a unique connection with the moon. It was one of the only sources of illumination on cold and dark nights, a guiding light so that weary travelers could find their way, and the inspiration for poetry, stories, myths, and legends. The brilliance of the moon doesn't just end here, however, and we're continuing to uncover fascinating findings when it comes to the relationship between the Earth and the moon. Today, we're going to be looking at 10 things you didn't know about our one and only natural satellite, and why it is even more brilliant than you initially assumed. If you're passionate about being inspired as we are, then please subscribe to this channel for an endless source of insights, explorations, and discussions. Number 1. There isn't a scientific consensus on how the moon was formed, but the prevailing theory is that the moon was created when a giant object collided with the Earth. This theory is known as the Giant Impact Hypothesis, and it is believed that the object would have been the size of Mars. Upon impact, the debris which was dislodged from the Earth attached to what was left of the object and became the Moon through force of gravity. Number 2. The solar system contains hundreds of satellites orbiting their planets, but the Moon is the largest satellite relative to the size of the planet it is orbiting. Typically, a satellite is a fraction of the size of its planet, as is the case with the 79 moons of Jupiter. With a diameter of 2,159 miles, the Moon is just over a quarter of the size of the Earth which is a significant percentage. Number 3. An eclipse is one of the most incredible cosmic phenomena to happen on our planet, and the only reason it is possible is because the Moon is the perfect size. You see, the Sun is approximately 400 times the size of the Moon, but it is also around 400 times the distance, in a unique consequence. If it were any smaller, an eclipse would simply appear like a black dot is moving across the Sun. Number 4. Due to the impact which supposedly created the moon in the first place, it has an unusual bulge on either side which makes it lemon-shaped. When the searing tidal forces were shaping the crust of the moon several billion years ago, some areas were heated up faster than others, forming the lemon shape instead of a perfect sphere. Number 5. Another fascinating consequence. The Earth's gravity has gradually pulled the tip of the oblong moon towards itself, creating a tidal lock. This means that even though the moon is constantly rotating, only one side of it is visible from Earth. This is known as synchronous rotation, as it takes the Moon just as long to complete one rotation as it does for it to orbit around the Earth. Number 6. The Moon influences the movement of the Earth's oceans. The gravitational force of the Moon is considerably weaker than Earth's, but it is still powerful enough to create tidal force and high and low tides. It is this force which makes the Earth's oceans bulge, creating a high tide on the side closest to the Moon and the side furthest away. Number 7. During the darkest of nights, the Moon is a comforting and brilliant source of illumination. Despite its brightness, however, it doesn't produce its own light. Instead, it reflects the light of the Sun and therefore becomes visible to us. It is for this reason that the Moon isn't constantly visible, because how much of the Moon we see depends on how it is angled to the Sun. Number 8. From afar, the Moon is a beautiful and familiar companion. If you were to land on the Moon without any protection or safeguards, however, you would discover an incredibly hostile environment. When the Moon is illuminated by the Sun's rays, its average temperature is 105 degrees, whereas at night, thermometers plummet to minus 115. Number 9. The near side of the Moon is always facing towards us, whilst the side of the Moon which never faces the Earth is known as the dark side or the far side. It is aptly named because no human had ever seen the side of the Moon for millions of years. That is, until human space exploration began less than a century ago. Number 10. Compared to Earth, the Moon is strangely still. There is very limited geological activity in terms of earthquakes, volcanoes, and mountains, so nothing has really altered its landscape apart from asteroid collisions. And since the Moon has virtually no atmosphere, there are no weather events either, such as winds or rain. Extra number 11. The Moon is slowly moving away from Earth at a distance of around 1.4 inches every year. This is happening because when the Moon's gravity interacts with the Earth's oceans, the resulting friction transfers some energy into the Moon's orbital motion, pushing it further and further upwards. Despite its proximity to us, there are so many things about our lunar companion which we have yet to discover. What we have learned so far, however, is that the Moon is not only an important part of our history, but the history of our planet as well. It is the reason that Earth had and continues to have the perfect conditions for life to develop and flourish, whether it is through creating our ocean tides or ensuring that our climate remains stable. That's all for this time. 
Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel for content that is truly inspiring, informative and relevant.